know. I know. Yeah. I know. Used to look at me like some wrong with that nigga Five years of age, swinging bats at my babysitter By the time I was seven, uncles had me drinking liquor Always loved my siblings, even though our daddy's different Wanted to eat, but we always couldn't When they did something wrong, I'm the one that caught the whoop. About your wife <laughs> Just grinding, man. No matter what it is, <coughs> music, whatever. A nigga get his hands on, a nigga gonna grind it out, man. Try to get it. So you know, <coughs> it's an all-around hustle, man. Business man, entrepreneur, go-getter, man. That's it. As far as an artist, for sure. You know what I'm saying? Myself as a person, I'm a street nigga or anything else so if a street nigga that really can focus on being an artist or the art you know what i'm saying you kind of gotta just kind of run with it so you know nigga just a street nigga that's an artist man that just go in just you know some real nigga shit gotta be a person before you an artist first of all you gotta what type of motherfucker you is like as an individual what type of nigga you is or whatever so my influence is like everyday shit negative shit haters you got family business money everything that just go into everyday shit that a nigga do everybody got the same mission man trying to get some motherfucking paper man you know what i'm saying not everybody but the niggas is trying to get motherfucking paper you know what i'm saying it's just, Trying to make a better way, make their situation better. You know what I'm saying? The music, me personally, I don't really define it. It's a couple tracks that I like, but I don't do music for me. The streets define my shit. The streets define me. If niggas don't like my shit, I don't do it. So niggas like my shit, people like it, bitches like it, females, women, all types of different types of people like the shit. So, you know what I mean? It's just they define you. You don't define yourself. You can't crown yourself. You can't be like, I'm king and you crown yourself. Nigga, the people got to crown you. It's the same type of, you know what I'm saying, respect and feedback you get from having your product out in the streets. You know what I'm saying? Accomplishments, just being relevant, just niggas knowing who I am, niggas knowing my name checking my movement whatever i got going on you know what i'm saying just being relevant out there you know promoting getting promoted whether it's good or it's bad just out there doing my thizzle man my thug thizzle you know what i mean uh, um you know pushing these albums mixtapes songs features you know what i mean trying to get on realizing that you ain't gonna get signed you know what i'm saying trying to put other niggas on you know different shit Really just, you know, make a living off of my my craft and my God-given talent, man, and, and really put on for my city like it really should be. The way my city want to be represented. And my city, you know what I'm saying, is Phoenix, Arizona, Bird City, and it want to be represented a certain way. So if it got to be done to a T a certain way in the city where I'm from. So really just to put put it on in a, in a, in a, in a whole nother, in a different way, a whole nother aspect of the game. Side, side by self, man. I got my own label. Niggas ain't gonna side me. Niggas ain't gonna pick up, you know what I'm saying? Niggas is problems and shit. You know, feel like people, if you gotta look at it from a investor, investor's perspective, ain't nobody gonna, if you in and out of jail doing shit, fucking up, and you got a million, two mil invested in your artist, your company, your investment, you gotta stay out of trouble, all types of other shit. You know what I mean? So I signed myself. So it's an investment in myself. I'm trying to get my ROI, my return on investment. You know what I'm saying? Instead of sitting around trying to get signed and shit, you know what I mean? Waiting on a motherfucker to put up some bread. 
But the only way you really gonna get to where you're trying to get to is if motherfuckers see you putting in your own bread. And that's just making money to get money. Later Bay be self Bay, man. It's Later Bay. Everybody asks me that. Later Bay Entertainment. That's the bread. That's the, the, the record label. That's the film company. We got the bottles. We got the shit for the kids. Everything. You know what I'm saying? Nader Maid is Nader Maid Entertainment. Niggas used to call me Wax, Waxinator, A Wax, all types of different waxes. I never really fucked with the name, but you know, niggas just, you know, back in the day, nigga, you earned your name. Niggas gave you your name. You just didn't say, nigga, this is my name, this is who I am. So, you know, um, it came from the Waxinator, man. They used to always call me that shit. Niggas just, this Waxinator, nigga, yeah, ha, ha, ha. You know what I'm saying? So, I took the Nader made, man, and just made it because I'm self made, man. Still pushing out in this motherfucking, out in these streets, man. We in the fucking streets, man. Right it. Just get it in. Do what you gotta do. Accomplishing your goals, man. Do what you gotta do, whether it's short term or if it's long term. You know what I'm saying? Getting where you wanna get to. You know what I'm saying? Doing what, doing what you wanna do. Doing how you wanna do. Push your fingers up, 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 Everything. Everything works in different phases. So whatever phase you want to do, if you want to do a promotional phase, a marketing phase, a grimy grinding phase, you know, different phases. So everything, whatever you set it out to be or where you're trying to get to, is an uphill battle. Two young skull I like. Uh, uh, Two dog niggas like. Uh, uh, uh. That's a good question. Um, honestly, I consider myself to be like a, a lyrical lyricist. I can, I can bang lyrics. I can get lyrical, you know what I'm saying? But niggas gonna overlook lyrics, you know what I'm saying? At a certain point in the game, because the game always changes. What's cracking in a game, what used to be cracking, what's finna be cracking, it always changes. So at the time that I was on that, I was like, I need to come up with some simple shit. You know what I'm saying? I just told myself, like, I need to come up with something simple to catch niggas' attention. And then when niggas catch attention, niggas just look into it and be like, okay, this nigga, all right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, you know, I had to catch him with the simple shit. And niggas like, okay. You know, certain niggas know, like, okay. Like, damn, that, that nigga, that ain't, that don't, don't get it twisted by that simple shit. You know what I mean? Just to get it out there. Just be honest and be serious about what you're doing. Next album release will probably be at the beginning of the year. I'm the first quarter. Working on a couple projects. They out there. Hit me on the Facebook and shit. Everywhere on the Facebook, what on what this review shit, iTunes, Amazon, Pandora, um, just anywhere online, however you want to access it.
Southwest, see the SW like that? That's what it is. Southwest, it's a whole region. Five years of age, swinging bats at my babysitter By the time I was seven, uncles had me drinking liquor Always loved my siblings, even though our daddy's different Wanted to eat, but we always couldn't When they did something wrong, I'm the one that caught the whoop. 